All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can make the coolest lo-fi beats using audio compression techniques. And we're going to use my latest single as an example. Go ahead and check that out. Technique number one, we're going to reduce the sample rate. So essentially what the sample rate is, it's basically how many audio bytes make up one second of audio. So if you have a higher sample rate, like um, 441,000, uh, you're gonna have very crisp, high quality audio. Which sounds bad, so we're gonna drop the audio down to um, something lower. So here we have our MP3 file, right here. And if you have a fear of commitment, make a copy of the high quality audio file. Uh, set it aside in a folder and never touch it again. Now you wanna take our first audio file and open it up in Audacity. Now, for those of you who use FL Studio, Audacity is basically Edison, but its own program. It's also very free, so you could try this trick right now. I'll even link it in the description so you can try it out after the video. All you have to do is go to this drop down menu, go to s sample rate, and um, select one. I like this one and it'll just reduce the sample rate right there. But oh no, it also slowed down the audio, you total buffoon. What you're actually supposed to do is press Control A to select all the audio, press Control X to delete all the audio and save it for later, then reduce the sample rate using the drop down menu. Then when you do that, press Control V to bring the audio back. Only now, this time it's in the reduced sample rate and it's ready to be used in your uh, nostalgic flash games. Uh, you know, if you have a time machine. And uh, don't forget to uh, export the audio, of course. All right, technique number two uh, involves audio compression using FL Studio. So we're gonna open this program up. Again, here's the high quality audio that we're using. Sounds pretty bad. So we wanna export this again with a reduced sample rate. Not so. bit rate. What what am I thinking? I'm going insane. So you want to go over to file, export, and I like to do MP3, and then you want a nice um, file name like uh, I don't know, uh, James. That's a nice name. Thanks. And you got a lot of compression settings for. Um, different audio formats like AUG and FLAC, which I've never heard of. So for MP3, you have this uh, this slider here. Normally it's set at like uh, 192 kilobits per second, at least that's how I set it. Um, but if you want really crunchy, crispy audio, you want it down to like 64 or uh, 32, depending on how much of a meme lord you are. And then just hit render and we'll listen to the final result. Oh, and uh, make sure you uh, set it to full song instead of pattern like I did. I'm such a doofus sometimes. There we go, that's, that's, that's more like it. Technique number three. I know images technically don't count, but honestly, what's the point of having a list if you can't have three items? It's it's, it's, all right, so for this technique, we're gonna be using the cover art for my single, which is already kind of compressed using a very overcomplicated process in MS Paint uh, that I don't think does anything. So I'm gonna show you an even easier way to compress. So you wanna open this up in GIMP. And if you have never heard of this, it's basically Photoshop, only it's also very free. Um, so I'll also link this in the description if you wanna check it out. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to File, we're gonna go to Export, and then like make sure the file extension is set to JPEG. This is very important. You have to type this yourself, by the way. JPG, JPEG. And then click this button. And then if you don't get this window, you're kind of screwed. But if you do get this window, good. Because you have this slider at the top. They literally give you a quality slider, like the memesters that they are. And you want to drop that right down to zero and click OK. And then look at the beautiful images that it comes up with. I mean, man, I can't believe I didn't go with this one. So anyway, that's uh, image and audio compression in a nutshell. Thank you very much for watching this video and uh, thanks for uh, sticking around. This has been a really good year for this channel. I'm very, very thankful for uh, the influx of views that I'm suddenly getting and uh, I look forward to uh, growing my channel more next year. So uh, happy holidays and uh, happy 2023.